Hello viewers, welcome to Tech Study Cell. In this video series, I am going to cover all the basic features of digital multimeter. In today's video, I am going to cover how to measurement current, voltage and frequency both in AC and DC with the help of digital multimeter. Here I am using this digital multimeter which is not auto select I have to select the range manually but parallelly I will explain the measurement procedure in case of auto select multimeter first to measurement the DC voltage with this multimeter we have to keep some point in our mind that the red lead of this multimeter should be connected in voltage and ohm terminal and black lead of this multimeter should be connected in common port or common terminal next I have to select whether I am going to measure AC or DC as here I am going to measure DC so I am selecting here DC next I have to select the range of the voltage V is written here which indicates the volt so as I know I am going to measure a 9 volt battery and a 1.5 volt battery so I am selecting range 20 now we can start measure the voltage first we are going to measure this 9 volt battery in this battery the positive terminal and negative terminal are indicated on the body so I am going to connect the red lead in the positive terminal and the black lead in the negative terminal so looking at the display of the multimeter it's showing 8.83 volt so battery voltage is 8.83 volt DC now same procedure for this 1.5 volt battery here also positive terminal and negative terminal are indicated so I am going to connect the black lead to negative terminal and the red lead to positive terminal and it's showing 1.5 Zero six volt. It's the voltage across this battery is one point zero six volt DC. Thus, we can measure the voltage across any DC supply. Now we will see the measurement in AC. Again, before going to measure the voltage across AC, I have to select AC as I am going to measure AC. Again, I have to select the range. Here, 600 volt is written. I am selecting 600 volt as in this case, I am going to measure our supply voltage which is 230. So, I am selecting the range 600 and the terminal position will be same now to measure the voltage across supply we have to connect this both lead across the supply terminal here I am going to connect the both lead of the multimeter across to measure the voltage now looking at the display it's showing 235 volt AC the supply voltage is 235 volt AC now we will measure the supply frequency now to measure the supply frequency the terminal position will be same just we have to select the hard scale here hard is written HZ so I am selecting that and in the display we will see the reading in kilohertz 
so to measure the frequency i have to connect the both lead of the multimeter across the supply here is showing 0 0.050 kilohertz which is 50 hertz thus we can measure the frequency now we will measure the current now to measure the current with the help of this digital multimeter first and most important things we have to do that we have to change the red lead of the multimeter from voltage port to milliampere terminal we have two current terminal is here one is ranging milliampere and other is 10 ampere range as i know i am going to measure the current within milliampere range so i am connecting the red lead in milliampere terminal if i am going to measure the range below 10 ampere or above milliampere range then i have to connect the red lead to 10 ampere terminal then we have to select the range here a is written which indicate ampere or amps and i am selecting 200 milliamps now we can measure the current as i am going to measure the dc i have selected the dc now to measure the dc current across this circuit i have to connect the both lead of the multimeter this way as i know the current is flowing in this direction this should be positive and this should be negative and this ammeter which is a digital multimeter should be connected in series so i am going to connect the both terminal in the circuit in this way so same circuit is implemented in this video board and i am going to connect the both lead of the multimeter as I shown now it's showing the value 7.2 milliampere now in the circuit a variable resistor trimmer is present by changing the resistance value of the circuit we can change the value of the current flowing through that circuit so I am going to do that uh, I am changing the value of this variable resistor as you can see in the display showing 7.3 if I if I decrease the resistance you can see the value is increasing so if I decrease the resistance the current in the circuit will increase now if I increase the resistance you can see the current flowing in the circuit is decreasing thus we can measure the DC current in any DC circuit the procedure of measurement of AC circuit is same just we have to select the AC instead of DC to measure the AC current I hope this video is helpful to you at the end of the video i hope you have understood how to measure current voltage and frequency in ac and dc if you find the video is helpful to you please hit like button and share it with your friends and please do subscribe our channel to encourage me to make such videos thank you for watching